welcome to SL Productions and my review to Doctor Who Planet of the Spiders. Oh, that's the wrong Doctor Who story. Arachnid in the UK. Whoa, who are you? How do you know my daughter? Something's happening with the spiders in this city. So yeah, hello and welcome to SL Productions and my review to Doctor Who Series 11 Episode 4, Arachnids in the UK. This episode was written by Chris Chibnall and yeah, in my opinion, this was probably either the second or third best in the series. I can't agree out of The Woman Who Fell to Earth or Arachnids in the UK, The Ghost Monument is my worst. So yes, what are my overall thoughts on this episode? I thought the plot was great, thought it was very tense, there was a lot of excitement, and it was quite a fun Doctor Who story as well, apart from loads of people getting killed, but overall, good, exciting plot. Also, great monsters, and yeah, just a really good concept. So yes, what did I think about the plot of this episode? So yes, what was the plot of this episode if you're watching in the far future? So basically, this hotel owner has a private contract with this rubbish disposal company who is dumping loads of rubbish in the mines of Sheffield, but also they are dumping carcasses of these spiders which are being experimented on. And this causes these mutations and the spiders are getting really big. So underneath this hotel where the mines are, there's loads of big spiders and it's basically the job of the Doctor and her companions and a bunch of other people to stop these spiders from spreading. And yes, basically they save the day by using the music to attract the spiders into this room to stop them from succeeding. So yeah, quite a good plot in my opinion. I didn't like the music and the conclusion to this story, but yeah, Overall, the plot was very good, very tense, loved the setting, and yeah, what did I think was good about this episode? So first of all, the guest stars in this Doctor Who story were great. I really did like the guest stars. There were loads of guest stars in this story, including the hotel owner, who was really good, really did like his American mannerisms and stuff like that, thought he was a great actor. Also, like the scientist, very good acting, and yeah. Great development in this story for the Doctor Who companions, saw some of their family. Also, we saw Graham's wife in this story, which I thought was really good, really did like that scene. Setting, great, really did like the setting of the hotel, thought it was a very tense and claustrophobic setting for a Doctor Who story. And yeah, the music overall was quite good in this story, apart from at the end with the grime music, I didn't like that. Kind of ruined it in the previous episode as well, when the pop song started playing. I thought they could have had orchestra. How do you say it? You know, you know what I mean. Classical music. So yes, what did I think was bad about this episode? So first of all, the CGI was a bit bad in this episode, especially for the spiders. The spiders weren't terrible, but the CGI wasn't great. And I can see why the CGI wasn't great, as BBC don't have the biggest budget. But for the budget they had, I think they were quite well done, but they could have been better. Also, at the beginning of the episode, when the TARDIS was going through the Time Vortex, I didn't like that, the Time Vortex. It was a bit like um, Sylvester McCoy's first episode in Time and Narani. The CGI was a bit like that, in my opinion. So, yeah, I didn't like the Time Vortex scene in this episode. Acting as well in this episode did have a few flaws, especially when the spider came out of the bath and the hotel guy started screaming. I thought his screaming was a bit wooden, so, yeah, I didn't like that. And yeah, once again, music wasn't the greatest with the grime music. And yeah, the hotel. The hotel was a good setting, but who builds a hotel in the centre of Sheffield? You know, Sheffield... Why Sheffield? Why not London? Who goes to a golf course in the centre of Sheffield? I don't know. But you know, great setting overall. Really did like the music and the plot. So yes. That is the end of this episode review. I personally rate it an 8 out of 10. So yeah, please let me know what you think of this episode in the comments below. And until the next time, goodbye. And yeah, before I end this video, I just want to say thank you for the overwhelming amount of votes on the Top 50 YouTubers 2018. Thank you so much for voting. I didn't think I would get so many votes. I have got over 500 comments, which is great. At least 250 people have probably voted. So yes, thank you. Voting is now closed. Now it's the time to add them all up. So yes. 
who will win? You will have to wait and see in the top 50 YouTubers 2018.